Recently, America prepared to provide monkeypox vaccines for high-rate case states. Monkeypox is a rare disease caused by infection with the monkeypox virus. The first human case of monkeypox was recorded in 1970. Since then, monkeypox has been reported in people in several other Central and Western African countries. Prior to the 2022 outbreak. Nearly all monkeypox cases in people outside of Africa were linked to international travel to countries where the disease commonly occurs or through imported animals. The Biden administration detailed plans to provide more vaccines and more testing to those who are most at risk of contracting monkeypox. States have been urging the administration to release more doses of the monkeypox vaccine from the strategic national stockpile. CDC Director Dr. Rochelle Walensky said, "Vaccination after exposure or using vaccines for post-exposure prophylaxis is meant to reduce your risk of becoming infected with the monkeypox virus and then become sick." Vaccination should occur within two weeks of a possible exposure, and the sooner you can get vaccinated after the exposure, the better. The vaccination plan may require the U.S. to use two different types of vaccines. The first is a newer, modern vaccine called Genis, which was developed to treat monkeypox infection. In the first phase of the rollout. The U.S. will make fifty-six thousand of the sixty-four thousand doses of this vaccine that are already in its stockpile available to the states. However, there aren't enough genius doses in the U.S. to vaccinate everyone who might need it. So, public health officials are also debating whether to employ an additional, more traditional vaccine called ACAM. BBS is up. Thank you for listening, and see you in the next videos. Goodbye.